all the strong families who are functional in our society. I know that all of us, the Filipinos of today, should be able to develop unity and excellence in a family where we belong. Each family will take the most valuable part in making the Philippines a better nation. And it will surely make us more proud of being Filipinos. There are different novel roles in a family should be portrayed. What are these roles? A family should be an astute architect who will plan for a bright future. A family should totally be a productive builder who will create new victories. The primary unit of society should also be an authoritative lawyer who will defend our nation from corruption and such evil things that are visible nowadays. A family should also imitate courageous policemen who extremely maintain peace on earth. A family should also act like a conscientious teacher who will impart and influence the values to everyone. Yes, it's really true. Every family can undeniably play important roles in the world. That's a challenge for all of us. Some of us want to make our nation better, right? We all wanted to help. We care for our country. But I'm warning you, my fellow citizens, don't you dare dream of making the Philippines the world's number one most progressive country. If you do not honor or love your own family, that's a big problem, if ever, because it all starts in our home. Do you think we can serve our country if we are not doing our responsibilities at home? Do you think we can unite everyone if our own families are currently being broken into pieces? It's a big and resounding no. A country is known for its one set of cultural norms and beliefs. The values and traits of its citizens are in double marks of our culture. Building a healthy, nurturing, and loving family is not a, a one-time process. It all starts in what we call love and care. When there are hardworking and loving parents, there is a nice home. When a mother and father teach their sons and daughters different lessons in life, they're leading them towards moral excellence. In the Philippines, we salute all parents who worked hard for the education of their children. As what they say, being a parent is a blessing. It is indeed a lifetime goal. Together as one, Filipino families should stand firm coupled with these values. Respect, hospitality, faith in God, and many valuable gems we pass should be empowered, generation to generation. Above all, there's a love for each other that binds a family together. And I quote Confucius. To put the world in order, we must first put the nation in order. To put the nation in order, we must put the family in order. To put the family in order, we must cultivate our personal life. And to cultivate our personal life, we must first set our hearts right. Let us all remember what the Bible says in Ecclesiastes chapter 8, verse 5. The wise heart will know the proper time and proceed. The bridge between a family and a nation. Alright, thank you, Raya. Thank you, Raya. So, right now, Jake, uh, I don't know if I'm going to...